Ashanti election headquarters, some constituencies in the Ashanti region are expected to witness an intense contest in Saturday's parliamentary primaries of the NPP. Over 120 candidates in the region will battle for slots in 41 constituencies where the party has majority incumbent members of parliament seeking re-election. Ahead of the primaries, Anabu Achiyarom puts a spotlight on the Adanse Asukwa Bekwai and Minshian of constituencies. The new Patriotic Party's parliamentary primaries will be held across 41 constituencies in the Ashanti region. This includes constituencies with incumbent MPs facing stiff opposition in their quest to seek re-election and constituencies where the MPs are retiring from Parliament. At the Mensha North constituency, the incumbent Member of Parliament, Akwasi Kunedu, who has served one term in Parliament, is facing a tough contest against former MP Collins Uso Amankwa and two others. Akwasi Kunedu says he's unfazed by the contest. There, there is nothing like complacency in this game. Once there is a ballot, yes. I am going in full force as I did. And currently, you can see the constituency is united behind me. They would want me to continue with the work that I've started. And I'm sure you can see the delegates behind me. They are going to say what will happen on the 27th. And I know, inshallah, and by his grace, victory is assured. But the former MP for the area, Collins Amankwa, says his quest to return to parliament is a call from the constituents. Wherever you go, um, people are craving for my comeback that I should come and continue with the laudable projects that I was uh, embarking on. Well, I think history is going to repeat itself because uh, uh, as we speak, after the balloting, uh, three candidates have been certified by the party. And uh, remember, uh, mind you, we, we, we contested in uh, 2016. I won and surely I'm very confident, having engaged the delegates, my message has gone down well with them and I can assure you that victory will be mine. In the Bekwai constituency, Joseph Osei Wusu is opting out of parliament after 16 years. This has opened the race up for four candidates, including retired Commissioner of Police George Alex Mensa and Raphael Lopokodise. For retired COP Alex Mensa, the delegates have received his message. Be elected in good as faith. the next member of parliament for the Bekwai constituency. And so, January 27th of January, what's your message to the delegates? My message to the delegates, I've always been telling them that COP is coming to make sure that the whole Bekwai constituency, we all come together and fight and make sure that our party breaks the edge. We're going to make sure that the Bekwai will continue to develop. I'm going to continue the good work that Honorable Jose also have been doing. I'm going to make sure that our young ones who are going to school, those who are learning handiworks are going to be motivated to make sure that we find jobs for our youth who are coming up. Ralph Pukwaduse also has his eyes on the Bekwai seat. For his camp, the optimistic of victory. We've met the delegates, that is the polling station executives. We've sold to them our, our views, our um, visions, our plans for them. And um, from their response, uh, it speaks to us that they bought into um, what we've told them. They appreciate the little that lawyer Raf has been able to do for them. And they are anticipating that um, should he become the MP, he will do more for them. So, yes, they've bought into his vision and his plans for the delegates. Adansia Sokwa constituency has three aspirants seeking to unseat incumbent MP KT Hammond, who has been in parliament for 24 years. I'm going to ask them if they know the constituency. I'm going to ask them what is it that they know about the constituency. Lead campaigner for the camp of KT Hammond, Andrew Edubwahin, says their team is optimistic of victory. We are, we are not looking for the win. The win is guaranteed. Um, the constituency executives and um, delegates know what is best for Adansia Sokwa. So the win is not an issue. What we are trying to do now is to give a percentage of votes. Whereby